hi welcome back y'all and welcome to my channel and if you're new here my name is liz and on this channel i talk about handbags accessories and plus size fashion all while on a budget and like i always say style and fashion is always yours and if that's something you like hit the notification bell because i upload about once a week and subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out so as you can see by the title i have handbags to show um that i've been loving that i have purchased and I just want to come on here and show some insight. I'm going to try to link everything down below that I can. Um, some of these bags are mostly familiar with my channel. So I think I have a review on every bag that I'm going to be showing. And I'm also going to be trying to do some cutaways if I can regarding some of these bags. Um, I'll leave them somewhere. So I know I have on shades. I'm not going to leave them on for the whole video. I was just feeling that the look just needed a pair of shades. So I would just still come on here with some shades, but I will be taking them off. So let's get started. So the first bag that I have is my Terry shoulder bag. And this bag, oh my goodness, when Coach came out with this electric red color, I fell in love. And this bag definitely can hold more than you think. I have a review on this bag as well. And this is one bag that I carried a lot for the summer, believe it or not. Um, I carried this bag for almost about two to three weeks. I usually rotate all my handbags weekly so I can just get use out of them. But this bag, I carry for at least about a good two weeks, I would say, at least a two weeks. So I definitely enjoyed this bag. And when Coach came out with this electric red, I was on board. This is something I was looking for for the summer. And look at it, it goes with my outfit for today. So let's take these, let's take the shades off. So the next bag that I have is, uh, okay. The next bag that I have is my Cassie 19. We all are familiar with this bag in the YouTube world. I fell, this, I fell in love with this bag when I first seen it. I can't wait. I call this the baby. I can't wait to get the mama because I still want the original Cassie. And I also want it in the C monogram from coach so I'm looking in to see if getting that maybe I'll get it for my birthday fingers crossed my birthday's in November so this bag here was a good carry for me um, I gravitated to this quite a bit it comes with three chains like I said I have detailed um, videos regarding the Cassie 19 and all these bags so if you're interested in any of them you could just link to my playlist watch my playlist and I will have everything down there but I love this bag. I love the C closure. It has, now see, I'm not a person who like compartments and bags, but when certain bags are constructed right and it's a need for it, no complaints. Like this bag, this bag has dividers, but these dividers are huge. It's meant for this bag. It's not a teeny tiny little bag. So I love this bag. It kept me organized. And the Cassie 19, you can't go wrong. You can dress it up or you can dress it down. And the next bag that I have is my favorite bags that I have been carrying for a long time. And these are my dupes for my Marc Jacobs, <laughs> Marc Jacob totes. So my daughter calls these ketchup and mustard because one's red and one's yellow. I know that's what she called them, ketchup and mustard. But anyway. I do have reviews on these bags. I love them. You can't go wrong with these totes. You can't go wrong with the totes. You just can't go wrong. I wore these totes also to death. They're favorites of mine. I love them. And I also have a new, a new one that I have put on to the collection with the totes. I'm currently using this one as we speak now. And this is basically almost the same, but I got this from Amazon as well. But this bag um, did come a little different. You notice it doesn't have the Marc Jacobs on it and it doesn't have the Marc Jacobs logo on the back, but it's okay. This has a little, the Sherpa on it. So this is like good for the winter months and the neutral color I love. So this is a tote that I have been wearing for the last week or so. I get a lot of compliments on, on these totes. I will try to link this down below as well. I didn't feel I needed a review on it because it's basically the same bags as the red and yellow one. 
that I have. So it's just from Amazon, it's from a different link. So this bag I've been loving. I've been wearing it a lot. And the next bag that I have is this bag, black satchel bag. So this is like my dupe of the Balenciaga bag, but Steve Madden has a great dupe. I will try to link, I mean, I will try to link it down below and I also put a picture somewhere, but the Balenciaga bag um, is definitely costly. So we opt for a dupe. So if you can't get one from Steve Madden, I will link this down below. This is from Amazon. This is a bag that I love to carry. This is something I probably would carry today just because of the to look. I mean, it goes with what I have on like right now. Even though it's silver, I don't mind mixing hardware, gold, silver. It's fine with me. And I like the slouch in this bag and it's very roomy. So I will be carrying this bag also for the fall and winter as well. And I also have a review on this bag on my channel as well. So one more bag I wanted to show that I carry a lot of when I go out and I'm going to grab it. It's this here. We call her Bromador. <laughs> and I call her Bromador just because it reminds me of a mix of the Brahmin and the Dior handbag mixed together. Maybe one day I will own a Lady Dior, but in the meantime, we will be carrying this one. And this bag is mostly something I would carry like on a date night if I was to go out. So this is one bag that I also love. I also enjoy. I have a video on this as well. So if you like what you see, hit that like button, comment down below if you have any questions and give this video a thumbs up and also hit me up on um, Instagram. Check me out over there, iStyle underscore Liz. And I want to thank you for watching my video. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you next time. Bye.